Welcome to The Daily Dish for Wednesday, May 28th. I'm Shay Passa. Today on She Knows, we're going to meet yet another dad on our Faces of Fatherhood panel, Matt McAfee. Five years ago, stay-at-home mom Heather Meiniger wanted moms to get together. It blossomed into the mommiesnetwork.org and subsequently into the Dads Network. Matt came on board to administer the Dads Network and to help create camaraderie and support for dads nationwide. He is father to a three-year-old little boy named Tyler, and he just had a baby girl named Caitlin 12 days ago. Today, we're asking our dads and you, what's the right time to start sex education for your kids? The weather is starting to warm up outside, and if you're like many families, you want to get out there. But before you do, we want to make sure you and your little ones are prepared. From bee stings, poison ivy, and ticks, she Knows has what you need to know for the great outdoors on She Knows Parenting. And as for indoor activities, let's talk about sex. For many parents, it seems that between kids and work, your relationship is at the bottom of your to-do list. GeoParents has the ingredients for a spicy marriage, even with kids in the mix. And in health, are you looking for an activity that will strengthen your immune system, improve your cardiovascular system, and make you feel better? How about just laughing? It seems as kids, we laugh about 400 times a day. By the time we're grown up, we've lost all of our sense of humor, laughing less than 15 times a day. One way to harness the power of laughter, laughing yoga. From India to California, classes are being held everywhere and people who are doing it swear by it. And if you happen to be in Scottsdale, you don't even have to go to a special class, just join me. Watching me do the downward dog is just funny. And speaking of the downward dog, today we feature a new segment of The Daily Dish, Sex Talk with Dr. Lori. It's everything you want to know, but we're afraid to ask. So we're gonna say a friend asked this one. Our first question comes in from Kimberly. She says, what is my vagina supposed to smell like? Dr. Lori? Everybody has a different body odor, and usually you'll have a vaginal scent that'll be very sweet, maybe musky. It shouldn't be pungent or foul in any way, shape, or form. But again, what we eat really will affect our body odor. It's those foods, the classic one um, is pineapple juice. Hey honey, how about a Malibu rum and pineapple juice? Anyway, that's it for us today. We want to hear from you and we want your questions, so be sure to write in to dailydish at shenos.com and you might just be on the air. I'm Shay Pasa. Thanks for being with us today. We'll see you tomorrow. Thanks for watching She Knows TV. Look for more of the Daily Dish at shenos.com.